Hey, uh, I just thought I'd make a really quick video because basically I looked for this video when I was deciding whether to buy Cyberpunk or not and it didn't exist so I took a risk and it ended up paying off so hopefully someone can get some use from, from this so what you're seeing here is me playing Cyberpunk with a frame rate counter in the bottom left um, and I'm playing it on a MacBook Pro, a 2017 MacBook Pro, um, middle of the range MacBook Pro, so it's got a, uh, it's got six cores, um, which are 2.2 gigahertz each, and then the graphical power is coming from an eGPU with a 2070 Super in it, and that's outputting at 1440p, um, and this is the result. So basically, my bottleneck came from my CPU, which put it down to about 40 frames per second even on the lowest graphic setting so I thought what I'm going to do instead of playing 60 uh, frames per second which I can't do I'm going to lock it to 30 and see how far I could push the graphics and once I started pushing the graphics it didn't stop I pushed it all the way and once I pushed it all the way I thought holy hell you know am I able to put ray tracing on this so I tried ray tracing, shadows, it worked, locked to 30. Um, lighting, it worked, locked to 30. And oh my god, reflections, locked to 30. So I'm amazed at the performance of this. There are no drops anywhere. There were some drops when I had it on um, a high level of population. So when you go into the city, but I think that's more to do with my CPU, to be honest. I don't think that's to do with the graphics. So, um, yeah, so I just wanted to show what I'm really happy with, you know. Most adventure games and, I, you know, role-playing games, I pay off 30 frames per second. Um, First-person shoot, first shooters, I do tend to play on 60 frames per second. But, you know, with the motion blur and... The um, I've set my mouse setting to you know low sensitivity. It feels great, you know, and I'm really happy, and I'm looking forward to playing the whole game. So I just thought I'd show some, you know, some gunfighting, some driving, some walking through crowded areas, and just show the performance because I'm so happy with it. You know, I've got full ray tracing, a 1440p output. There is some dy dynamic resolution scaling, but not much. I've turned it on and off and I, you know, it's hard to see the difference. Um, and yeah, I'm, you know, I'm really, really happy with it. So if somebody's wondering whether to purchase it with a MacBook Pro via an eGPU with a decent graphics card, you know, I'd recommend it, you know. I'm so glad I purchased it on my PC as opposed to uh, my Xbox Series X, but here we are. So yeah, I'm looking forward to playing the game. You know, I'm not great at great at it as you see here but you know I don't need to be great at, great at it to show it off so anyway yeah so that's it just a really quick video to, to show the performance of Cyberpunk on a MacBook Pro via an, an eGPU um, with full settings and ray tracing 